Meet the Fletchers, Dad, Ben, with his encyclopedia of dad jokes, Mom, Mandy, the DIY queen, 12-year-old Sammy, an aspiring inventor, and 8-year-old Jenny, who believes she's destined for pancake-eating stardom. Oh, and Waffles, their cat who adores pancakes. One sunny morning, the Fletchers packed into their quirky minivan, decorated with bumper stickers of breakfast foods, bound for the International Pancake Festival. Their mission? To support Jenny in the pancake eating contest and showcase Sammy's invention, the Pancake Cannon 3000. As they hit the road, Ben began with his jokes. Why did the pancake go to space? To find Pluto! Groans filled the van. Two hours into the drive, Mandy realized she forgot the map. No worries, Ben declared. My sense of direction is infallible. Spoiler alert, it wasn't. Soon, they found themselves lost amidst cornfields. Mandy decided to build a makeshift compass, while Sammy tried to reprogram the Pancake Cannon 3000 as a GPS. As they resumed, Sammy accidentally hit the launch button. Pancakes were propelled from the cannon, splattering onto the windscreen, the roof, and a scarecrow that seemed amused. A pancake landed squarely on Waffle's head. The cat took it as breakfast served. An hour later, they approached a small town where an amateur magic show was in progress. A magician, with an abysmal act, was being booed. Time to cheer them up with pancakes, declared Sammy. The Pancake Cannon 3000 launched pancakes into the crowd. Cheers erupted as pancakes flew. Even the magician caught one with his hat. With directions from the grateful townsfolk, they set off again. But there was another surprise waiting. They had picked up a stowaway, a lively chicken from the town that made itself comfortable in the van. They finally arrived at the International Pancake Festival, but Jenny was late for registration. Waffles, wearing shades, was enlisted as stand-in until Jenny could replace him. As Jenny was called up, Waffles accidentally jumped onto the pancake cannon, triggering a pancake cascade. People were delighted. Even the judges were in splits as pancakes soared overhead. Jenny made it just in time, and fueled by the excitement, set a new pancake-eating record. The Fletchers were awarded the Spirit of the Festival Prize for their unexpected, hilarious contribution. Sammy's pancake cannon was hailed as a comedic sensation, and even Waffles got a year's supply of pancakes. On their way back, the Fletchers dropped off their stowaway chicken with a stack of pancakes and as a tribute to their adventure, named it Syrup. The great pancake cannon fiasco became a cherished family tale of the day when pancakes, laughter, and a dash of chaos turned a simple road trip into an unforgettable, hilariously pancake-filled adventure.